Hey everyone, with GTA 5 being in the news lately, I've gotten the itch to play the game again. I haven't played it since it first came out, and I thought, well, if I'm going to play it again, why don't I look up and see if there's some cool mods to make it interesting. And I found a Neptunia mod. Neptunia has always been a big thing on my Twitch channel. Not so much my YouTube, but all you need to know is all the, a lot of the models in the game have been replaced by various Neptunia girls or Compile Heart girls, and that just makes it absolutely hilarious. So... I've played it over my Twitch stream for two days so far. Uh, it's been one of the gags that have been going on on my Discord channel. People have been posting virtual YouTubers and their general obsession with them. So as a gag, we, I did my best impression of a virtual Twitcher on the first day. So if you see a uh, talking nep in the corner, that's just my short-lived uh, virtual Twitch career. Looks like I'll have to retire already. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the clips. If you... Uh, let me know what you think. I'll try and make some more highlights as I play this game on my Twitch channel. It's been a lot of fun revisiting this game and playing in HD and actually being able to aim with the uh, mouse and keyboard on PC. So anyway, I'll talk to you in the next video. Your son, James. He's a good kid. He's a good kid? A, a good kid. Why? <laughs> Look how poor. No, he sits on his ass all day, smoking dope and jerking off while he plays that fucking game. If that's our standard for goodness, then no wonder this country's screwed. And what about you? What about me? Hey, I don't have the advantages that kid has. By the time I was his age, I'd already been in prison twice. I robbed banks. I ran whores. I smuggled dope. And you consider them achievements? <laughs> these were the opportunities I had. Yeah, the cutscenes are messed up because they're so and short. Where did these opportunities get you, Michael? They got me right fucking here. The end of the road. With a big house and a useless kid. And I'm stuck talking to you because no one else gives a shit. Oh, I'm living a dream, baby. And that dream is fucked. It is fucking fucked. Let it all out. <laughs> I think I just did. <sighs> oh. Well, I think that's all we have time for. The same time next week? I guess. Nope, oh, oh. penny shot. I gotta tell you, I ain't too sure this shit is working for me. Hmm. Well, a sense of overriding futility is a vital part of the process. Embrace it. Whatever you say, Doc. It's kind of funnier with uh, just the normal voices. But yeah. Alright, so Michael's nap. His wife was what? Uzume? I don't, don't, they don't need to tell me. It'd be funnier to find out myself. I know just how you feel. Man, shit gotta be around here somewhere. Unless they buried it under the sand, fool. Another gray in the market. Oh, God, they're ramming ROM. Fuck you. Hey, excuse me, homie. Can you tell me where Berto Beach House is? No, homie, I cannot. Man, would you come on? Fuck. Actually, yeah. Fuck, which was which again? Ram was blue, right? Ram was pink. Good looking out, homie. Appreciate it. Man, get your stupid ass on. Damn. Why don't you ask him if he knows the fucking owner? Or better yet, do some sky riding and reads there's a couple niggas here about to boot some balls in case somebody didn't realize. See, what you don't realize is that this shit is legit business. Legit? Oh, yeah, I forgot, huh? 401ks, tax returns and all. Yeah, right. You the one all pumped up on doing this lick, nigga. I'm hey, Shinori. Money in the hood. I'm straight, fool. I'm cool. You cool? 
Cool what? Slanging dope and throwing up gang signs? Yeah, right. Whatever, homie. Yeah, homie, this the spin knot right here. Your boy Simeon wasn't bullshit. Man, get your ass in here. Bring your ass, fool. Always trying to boss somebody. Come on. At exorbitant interest rates. But tomorrow, together, I never had a black son. But if I did, I want him to be just like you. No, no, nigga. Hello, What's up, man? Man? What's up, homie? What's up, then, homie? What's up, dog? Franklin here has been awarded Employee of the Month. You fucking with me, right? <laughs> man, we both being fucked with, dog. Man, knock it off, man. For real, after all the motherfucking work I put in, man. Man, fuck this Employee of the Month shit, homie. I'm sitting up here trying what to get What you mean, us fuck this Employee of the Month shit, man? When it's some shit to be won, goddammit, I want it. I don't give a fuck what it is. You know what I'm talking about? I take no prisoners. I go hard doing this shit. Big dog, big nuts. When names is on the motherfucking board, I want to see my name at the top of that motherfucking next to it and need to say, winner. <laughs> hey, maybe next month, huh? Man, fuck next month, Simeon. What about today? I, I demand a retry. Don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe if you got rid of that old yee-yee ass haircut you got, you'd get some bitches on your dick. Oh, better yet, maybe Tanisha will call your dog ass if she ever stop fucking with that brain surgeon or lawyer she fucking with. Nigga. What? You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Amanda! Amanda! You better not be! Not in my house! Fuck you, Michael. Go away! I'm paying that turd 150 bucks an hour to fuck my wife in my own bed? Michael, go away! No, I'm sorry, bro. She said you had an arrangement. You and I are gonna have an arrangement. I'm gonna arrange your fucking funeral. I'm really sorry, bro. I'll cop the session. I promise. You are dead, man. Oh. Fuck. Dead! Come here! Ah! Fuck, man. Hey, you! Stop it! What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked a brick in my bed. <laughs> you bullshitting. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. I can actually use his, uh, Uzume's, uh, swimsuit model. Or outfit, rather. Alright, now to take the truck that's, like, hard to steer. Scared of dogs, nigga? Oh, shit! You and your stupid dog. Don't hump him. Bite his ass, chop. Get it. Oh, fuck up. Oh, son of a bitch. That bitch just fucking bit me, man. Shut the fuck up. Hey, man, get over here. Oh, shit. What the fuck, man? I ain't got no beef with the CTF. Cause maybe we doing that. Go away. What? You know, go watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah. You would have no fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford, so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Dad, come on now. An I find alert. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. I don't think I have too much of it, but yeah, if you find any of it, take it. 
I heard him say I might have like two America. or three. What, by outsourcing all the jobs? By but it's probably in various boxes. Bits of plastic restricted access shit. Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. The hell Ooh, are you talking about? Turd. You are about to get that white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45 year old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? Alright. Let's change your outfit. What should we wear? I don't know which one looks like which. Okay, there's that. I don't think we've actually worn this at all yet. Yeah, Kampa and Ify are the kids. Uzume is the wife. All right. The plan is simple, elegant. Listen to Lester, pay attention to the information he gives you and we'll all make a buck. If things go bad, you know the drill. This wasn't organized. We don't know each other. We got Keisha. We got caught up in a robbery and acted in self-defense. But it's not going to be an issue because everything's going to go just fine. The um, the uh, alarm system is easy. Now, if I didn't need to be running things, I could have it offline myself. No problem. But uh, you should be able to get us a pretty decent window. How decent depends on the job you do. Now, uh, once it's down, you signal Michael. He makes the call. Things look good. We should be able to drop a present right through the air bin on the roof. Everybody goes to sleep, no problem. We take our time. If we run into trouble, we move quickly and with force. Any questions? No? Let's go. All right, people. We need to split up. They're going to be looking for a crew. I'll wire your cuts when the rocks have been sold. That shit was crazy, dog. So what now? We get out of here. Keep our heads down. Hey, you did good, kid. What'd I tell you, Lester, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, look, everybody take off. Hey, Franklin. Listen, Lester and I got some things we gotta clean up. I want you to stop by the house a little later on. We'll celebrate, all right? All right. Okay. <laughs> huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. We're back in action. Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Woo! Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file. What is wrong with you? Davey! Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked. Hey, don't worry about hey, Trevor. Trevor's dead. Gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Nothing. Really? The criminals are believed to escape with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey. rings. Albert's story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, hey, you gotta move these bikes. I don't know anything about that. <laughs> this other guy runs out of the shop and pushes the door and says something like, You forget thousands of things every day. You make sure this is one of them. That's pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor! I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Well, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? Is that the problem here? 
Take off your pants, cowboy, all right? Let's, let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums, huh? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh. I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. I don't mean nothing by it, man. I just... I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug, yeah. Fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Don't be cowboys forced our hand. We gotta find the rest of the lost. Hey, Spud. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Okay, there he She's got it. I barely clipped it. Okay, now we follow the van back. But any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, uh, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. What's up, mother? <laughs> you speak Spanish, speak it to each other. Mr. Tao Chung is pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. What the is wrong with him? I'm out. No, don't go. Please. <laughs> nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right. Gentlemen, please. Come check out the storage facilities. Go on now. Nice, right? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Ample room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out. No. So fun. Tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. Should we get the guns? Yes, chef. Help me! Uh, if I knew we were having visitors, what is that little spring clean? They really want you dead. Sure. That's fine. At least I didn't break my neck. Get back here. You're not even hidden. Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. I thought you said you weren't going to hit me. I thought you said you were going to find fucking Michael Townley. There's two Michael Townleys living in L.S. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but... She threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. 
Shut up before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael Gesanka, about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda? Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo! Uh, uh, don't you ever not tell me things I want to know! Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard! Get out here! We're going to Los Santos! Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money and tidy my shit up. Let's go, Wade, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? Um, <laughs> so, so we're heading to Los Santos then? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Road trip? We taking this one? Get in! Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's your... Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you wait! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here. He's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. <laughs> you can't smoke. Fuck, who is this again? Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was called Nevelyn's bed. A guy we've never proved. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend? She'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Wait, uh, I ain't got no booze. Oh, that's you right. Know, His I'll girlfriend, like, bullies him and, you and whatnot. Right. He's a ah. loser. There you are, you little shit. You looking for this? No. Very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Hmm. Yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this grand, huh? Yeah, well, I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in a big mansion. Awkward situations. It's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all out. But it was a long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. That's great. That's great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. Nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, eh, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. Uh, good Lord. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's, a, uh, she's, a, uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for Fame or Shame. Fame or Shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it, you guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ, she's a horrible dancer. Michael! Come. She might disagree with you on that. Jesus Christ, what, now, now, where? 
Um, the Maze Bank Arena. Ah, oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go, we go get her. We? Yeah, we. What, are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go, come on! Alright. <laughs> it's so much better with the neps. Make yourself at home. He's got a little show to do here. Okay. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music! Take what your daddy's gave you, honey. Mm. Get down. Stuff a 20 in me. Oh! Can you fucking do something about this? Uh, uh, that's enough. Oh! Oh! I said that's enough! Oh, 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 hey, hey! I got security! Security! No. What'd you fucking Hold say? Hold it, come on, big guy! Come no. right there! No. Come on! Fuck no. Come here, you little shit! No. Tracy! Go home! I just want to talk to you. Hey, whoa, back off there, cowboy. I know my constitutional rights. Anyway, I know you're coming here to suck cock, so it's all right. What the fuck you talking about? Wow, well, hey, look, I saw a quarterback blues, man. And, you know, some of those older records of yours, even they sound a little bit closeted, I'm just saying. What? A black man walking in vine, would you think he clay PG sellout? You bitch-ass punk oh. motherfucker. Oh, shit, man. Oh, hey, I'm sorry, dude. I didn't, didn't have my, my contacts in, you know? I mean, I love black people. Yeah, you know, like, uh, like... I love gangsters. I love, like, gangster rap. Yo, sup? Man, who gives a fuck if he's gay or not, man? The man is not married. It's his business. Leave motherfuckers alone. Well, yeah, look, I'm, I'm just saying that, that it's uh, it's the hypocrisy yeah, that gear. I can't stand. You know, I mean, of celebrities. I mean, PG, right? He, he, he says he, he's a killer and a murderer and all that great stuff. And then, what, he, he loves his mother and likes show tunes. I mean, really, what kind of message is that sending our kids? You know what I'm saying? The guy's a fraud. Well, why do you care, man? Oh, yeah, because... All right, this is no good. The coppers are after me. They know I stole the pudding. You make me wanna Damn, I can barely see out the car. How am I supposed to do this? Hey, you. Really? Oh, God. We on foot now. Alright. I gotta go out in style. I don't think I can get away. If you can't trust a hooker to hold you through the night, who can you trust, eh? 